Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Honotrak and we are playing Stellaris on Grand Admiral difficulty with the newest DLC, Megacorp, all that kind of stuff as the Church of the Brain Slugs. Praise the Slugs! Praise be! We have found our northern neighbors over here, the Lillerobius hegemony, and these guys reacted pretty well to Brain Slug Diplomacy. Brain Slug Diplomacy is just chuck all the resources that you have at them in the hopes of them liking you more, uh, which kind of worked uh, for a little bit but uh, they went for a commercial pact and then kind of did not go for a commercial pact again that is a bit sad but what can we do like that's I, yeah I don't know the desecrated tomb kind of needs to improve um, and we're gonna stay at plus 30 let's hope that this isn't going too badly they are superior maybe we can still be be friends with them I would feel much better if I had a defensive pack with these dudes so I think what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna we're gonna try to make friends. So we're gonna offer them a trade deal. Um, so you look like you maybe blow in alloys, um, and I want you to have some. So just as it is, we're just gonna get alloys. Actually, we can also do kind of the same with minerals. Mm, is that enough? So I have 500 minerals and 200 alloys. Brain stuck diplomacy. I'm sure this is gonna work. They're gonna love us. Okay, so they're happy about this. So yeah, defensive pact. Sure, let's let's do it. it Costs us one each month, but this. Okay, so these guys are no longer guaranteeing us because we're allied to their rivals, but let's just say I'd rather be rival to, uh, um, allied to the hegemonic imperialists, uh, which are a proper empire, um, than to these guys. We can still be friends, come on. Don't, don't be like that. Don't be like that, dude. We can be, we can be the best of friends. I'm just saying. You just gotta think and keep an open mind, you know? Just keep an open mind. That's that's all I want. So we're building a star base down here. We're still trying to kind of close all the gaps that we have in our space. Hmm. Do we? Yeah. Let's move into Suzuno. Okay. So I have I have two defensive packs now. With these guys and the others. This also signals these dudes that um, maybe not to get into a conflict with them. Like, we're, we're, we're all friends here, you know? We're all friends. Close the borders to the Helvins already, but maybe we, maybe we can do something. We're not don't gonna declare any rivalries or anything. That is what you normally would do if you are low on, on stuffs. But, uh, yeah, we're not gonna do that. I do want to build a starport up here. Uh, I should probably also kind of try to get the trade value although if i if i upgrade the the base in my capital we should be fine uh yeah we're not looking too hard in terms of military power that's just how it is but we'll, we'll deal with the situation we are kind of growing our our colonies here so we have nine jobs on this one eight pops uh we have a fair few of these Karelians, which are taking jobs in our empire Mm. So how how is that looking? So Special migration complete. people are migrating away. Uh, recovered a probe. Can't distribute amenities the right now at least. Have granted us new wisdom. Okay, so we have the hangers. Ooh crystal mines we do have a crystal in our space but this is this is actually pretty awesome making our corvettes much better man now i'm getting these like right away when i was playing in the christmas mp i didn't get either of the hull strength increases for my corvettes construction which complete. is pretty nasty phew like just as a general rule it it sucked now, we have very low naval cap at this point, and we did not go for the supremacy traditions, which is probably complete. gonna bite me in the ass at some point. And yeah, there's still the salvage gas giant ship. Let's let's do that. 
And then alien weapons. Probably have to go after these guys first. I think I will go for one more. So. Situation log updated. Let's go for the research project first. Let's look after the organic remains. Anomaly found. Okay, very good. I'm still hoping that we get the, the precursor stuff soonish. So Lilla Robius Prime complete. now has the Temple of Prosperity, and this is gonna push people towards the spiritualist ethic. They have a very high stability, but it doesn't matter in this case, because they, they went for the commercial pack. They have to declare war to like take that away. They might they might not. It might just not be worth their their effort. Let's see how it goes. It's just a period, but I'm, I'm building up the fleet so that we look a little bit stronger. Um, let's actually bring the fleet down here to, to f deal with this. Okay, and here, I'll just build all the things, build all the mining stations, and then we'll move you over here to, to get those alloys. Alloys in space, just, we're just leaving them around, lying, lying around, not doing anything with it. It's not good. So signs of precursor activity. Fergthulu is already on it, I think. Right? Automated shipyard. So where's that in the algo wrap system? We're gonna need a construction ship over there, so let's do that. Let's do uh, let's see what we get out of it. We might just get a couple of ships out of it. Uh, depending on what you roll like you're kind of rolling the dice and depending on what you do you get some things out of it well, we have organic remains ah here this is signs of precursor Special activity Special project right. complete okay we get another cybrex artifact so how many of these do we have three of six well we're still pushing forward in terms of like surveying reasonably well we have the hostile fleets in here. This should be doable. It's just one ship against like a bunch of ours. Let's see how that goes. What are you even? Void cloud subspace entity. This is... Yeah. Come on, guys. You, you can do this. Why did our... Oh, no! Our power dropped. That's not good. That's uh, actually reducing the military power of our ships. Significantly. Anomaly found. And there are signs of more precursor activity. Awesome. We might still be able to get Cybrex Alpha. We might still be able to get it. Okay, so we defeated the anomaly. We gained survey data for the from the system, which is uh, alien weapons. Okay, so we didn't get any debris out of this. That's interesting. Also, kind of sad. Let's build more ships. Let's at least fill this fleet to the to the max so we don't look too weak. Um, let's just chuck some additional minerals on the market. And what we're going to do is build a corporate office on the capital. That's actually going to give us a lot of money. And what we're going to do is build a temple on there. Hail the brain slugs. Uh, we also get some nice information about their home system. So we know that these guys complete. are about equally strong as these guys, which means we don't have to worry too much about it. I think that's what I'm yeah, that's what I'm gonna think there. So we have two uh we have an unemployed person. We could actually send that unemployed person to Fidjon. And I don't think we want to. What do we need on here? Yeah, I see, we're making a ton of money now. Nice, very nice. So this is gonna be a food planet from the looks of it. So might as well start farming on here. We also really do wanna remove some of this, but apparently we don't have the talk. Construction tech Oh no, complete. yeah, we, no, we just need the money. Okay, we'll, we'll wait, we'll wait. This is fine, this is fine. We're still doing very well. I'm happy about this. So we have plenty of anomalies. We're getting alloys now at a very decent rate. Uh, our influence income is kind of shitty. And we can also probably not continue this. Although, let's just do that. No, this is, there's no way. Okay, this will do it. Yeah, we want more research speed. Research speed is always good. 
Unity income is probably not sufficient at this point. We definitely need the admin cap. Like the 20 admin cap is going to help us massively. For sure. Um, once these planets are grown, uh, things will look much, much better. Okay, so the Helvans are riding the Little Robius. The Tricposian are riding the Little Robians. So these guys... Yeah, okay, so no, we're enemies now. Desecrated Tomb, Border Friction, Spiritualist Fools, Allied to Rivals. We might actually... We might, it might come to blows here. Um, can we... I mean... We could go with the rivalry. I don't necessarily want to be the enemy. It's some sweet influence, though. We're probably never going to become friends at this point. Because they hate the Helvins. I'm not going to give up the Helvins, either. So... Yeah, no, we're not going to declare any rivalries. I'm. This is just going to be the way that this series works. We're just going to stay friendly. Stay classy. Um, just do our thing. Do our thing. That's gonna be that's gonna be what we do. So we build some gun batteries here. Uh, I really wanted to target uplink computer too. In the beginning, stations can actually help you defend your space quite a bit. Okay, the little robots closed their borders, but we System still have survey complete. the branch office on this planet, and these guys are still like giving us um, money and was converting them oh they have records growing here yeah, interesting special project complete okay brother Eric Todd now has field manipulation awesome okay yeah I like that you are like, gaining new skills and knowledge that's good I applaud that for sure um oh we got a cruiser okay sure I take it so, you have no orders, but Eric Todd, you are gonna go. Actually, you really should go with just automatic exploration. Just because you have the, the meticulous, which means you're gonna, you're gonna probably get us some additional anomalies, which I love. Anomalies are great, that's exactly what you want. Up here, I don't really care that much about the anomalies, but inside my space, I want them because they're very helpful. I hope that these guys won't expand into this space. That would kind of annoy me. Normally, they don't do that. I have never seen the AI be that aggressive, but they could theoretically do it. Um, could reinforce the fleet further with 15 or 20. We're almost at the uh, at the cap. We'll merge the cruiser in and just call it a day. Mm. Yeah, nothing else System over here. We're repairing the automated shipyard, which is probably going to give us additional ships. We might actually have to build an anchorage. We had four or five star bases now at this point, though, so this is good. I like it. This means we can build another um, leveled up star base. Uh, we're getting some trade value in the tour system. I should probably try to collect that. Maybe even upgrade Sluggish over here. So Exilion needs to get some gun batteries and the target uplink computer because I'm also not trusting these guys. I mean, they haven't really been aggressive towards us, but it might happen at any point in time. Uh, that kind of scares me. It just kind of scares me. It doesn't... Incoming transmission. It's probably not the worst. Yeah, we have a migration treaty. Sure. Yeah. Let's migrate. Construction These guys are complete. not xenophobes. They're just uh, fanatic militarists. So they love to fight, but they don't necessarily hate any aliens. They're more like the, the Klingons or anything. Okay. So... Situation cyber, log updated. Research station. Awesome. Uh, research this. Just, just watch Cybrex Alpha be somewhere that we can not at all reach. Just watch. And then, are, are, are we going to go to war? I don't think so. Ah, damn it. 
So, no, actually, we got three advanced raiders. Right, so we're a little bit above our naval cap, but it'll be, it'll be okay. It will be okay. So now these guys should at least no longer be overwhelming. Yeah, they're only superior, which we can live with. We're also getting 23 units of food now. Like that. A lot. How is the population? 32 and 31. Yeah, your capital planet's still smaller than mine. We have a bit of a problem with the growth because people are still rushing towards the newly founded colonies. <sighs> what can you do? I mean, life on the capital should kind of convince Anomaly these guys that found. things are better there, but what can I do? Mm. Number of hops greater than 10. We should almost be there. Yeah, we're actually gonna get this out of the colony area into the normal planet Special area. Special project complete. Okay, we're getting another Cybrex artifact, so... Revealed that the machine consciousness was experimenting with cybernetic life forms. Hundreds of unfortunate prisoners were transported to this facility for the purpose of having their limbs and organs replaced with various mechanical contraptions. The exact objective of these tests remain unclear. There's no evidence that the Cybrics ever made use of cybernetic units outside of this lab. Okay. Uh, that happens. It's not very nice that it happened, but it happens. Yeah, next thing that we need is uh, a way to take all that trade. Uh, we're also going to need some hangar ships to deal with any unniceness that is going to happen. So we have nano sand. We have an Elgate insight. Okay. Rom's here. Over here. System survey complete. I take the Elgate insight. I don't want to open the Elgates, but I, I want the insights. That's probably good. Um. Oh, I can't merge these. Create a fleet that is over our fleet command limit. That's fine. That's that's totally fine. We'll, we'll be okay with this. Let's build a mining station over here. I don't think I want to grab any of this space. Like, we, we have already more than enough space. There's nothing that's really going to entice me to do anything. Unless there's maybe like a ruined science nexus in here or something. Um, what I want with all that space? Nothing, basically. Okay, let's take the the admin cap, which means we're at the uh, below the cap now again. Construction Makes me complete. very happy. Let's upgrade this, making it a proper colony. Awesome. System survey complete. So how's that going? Two point seventy five. So do we have some of these dudes growing on our on our planets? Yeah. Okay. Two of Prime is is having these guys growing. Um, what are you? What are you? What are you good at? Like these guys are agrarian, traditional, and slow learners. Okay. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. We befriended our our closest neighbors just by giving them massive amounts of uh, resources. <laughs> Which, yeah, I mean, you gotta do it in one form or another, I guess. <laughs> we have really good research stats, though. I think, like, we have an additional building slot. I'm sorely tempted to actually like check another uh, research building on it, but I think we're gonna go temple. I think we're gonna go temple here, just for the additional unity and amenities and all that kind of stuff, making people spiritualists on the planet, because like, we have people that have come newly onto the planet that need to to hear the good word. System survey complete. So this should, yeah, this should go up. Once we have both of these planets built up properly. Let's go ahead and encourage the planetary growth over here. We're getting a good amount Evading of food now. Heretics. What? Shadow Fleet? The heck? Don't kill Brother Ferg Thulu. I'm gonna be so mad if you do. Gonna be so mad. Okay, there's still plenty of space that you can that you can go for, for Cthulhu. That's it's not a problem at all. Just find me those precursors. We need them. So these guys from Planet Trade Value, free traders, ten percent. Why are these guys not bringing anything in? Hmm, it's weird. Seventeen, thirty-nine. Okay, no, I totally get that. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Get the Xenobiology. Awesome. So do we take the naval cap or the habitability? 
Oh man, having more habitability on planets is is pretty nice. Hmm. This reduces the amount of consumer goods and food and all that we need on the planets. We could use more naval cap though. That's for sure. Um, I don't really want to build up all that much. How are these guys? Are they now super hostile? They aren't friendly, but they're not hostile. They just, they don't like me, but they are, I don't think they're looking to actively kill me. So we take the 5% habitability for sure. Monetary administration, make it happen. I want it. Construction complete. And here we're also getting towards it. 2.77. Why is uh I mean they have a little bit of immigration, but genome mapping, nutritional planetude, new life from pops, pop jobs. Yeah, we're getting like a bunch, but it's not enough. Oh no, oh, come on, the little Rovius declared us the arrival. Could you not have done that sooner? Construction complete. Oh, they're also very far advanced in terms of their stations that they can build. Really? Okay. I see how it is. Definitely want to upgrade our station up here. I think. Kind of scares me that they are that strong. So let's do this. Upgrade this to a star hold. Might be overkill, but it probably isn't actually. It probably is not because having unfriendly neighbors that you know of. Oh man, there's, there's dark matter down here. Hmm. There's an arctic world. What we could do is <clears throat> terraform this, then give it to a vassal. That might not be bad. I mean, I don't want to hold on to it myself, but if a vassal has it, at least my enemy doesn't have it. Right? Okay, so you come over here. We have a lot of trade value in the area. I probably need a trade station to collect this stuff. The problem is, once I start collecting the trade, we might get we might get pirates. Um, this is gonna be the slug the slug yards. So these are these are our shipyards. We're gonna gonna build a station in there so that I can pull the, um, the shipyard modules off the capital system station. I think that's going to be good. So it's no longer going to be the Evrip system, it's going to be the slug yard system. That's good. Mm, I have an unemployed person complete. on the capital. Hello. Okay. Still have a little bit of a uh, small amount of people going away. And some of them are leaving because of unemployment. But in general, this is nice. Do we... Like, we could just resettle that person to this planet, which I think I will do. So, resettle to a prime. So we're going to resettle to two a prime, the unemployed brain slug host here to make it easier to get somewhere here. Uh, we'll, we'll build another, we'll build another district here, build another agriculture district. Anomaly found. Yeah, very easy. Nice. Oh, we still have, we still have a thing over here that we, that we need to go for with our, with our ships. Um, or is there a ship like going for that? No. It isn't. So, which one do we want? We, we take Brother Eric Todd. Brother Todd, you will go research project and research anomalies. And I guess then automatic exploration. So, that's that's cute. That's looking good. Yeah. It's still unfriendly. They. I'm not going to declare rivalry. That's just not how we roll. It's just not how we operate. Well, yeah, I, I could see them. I could see them attacking us, I guess. But we have a double defensive pact, so it's probably not going to happen unless they find someone that can help them. I don't see any alliances or anything. The thing is, if I if I were to rival them, I might potentially be able to get on these guys' good side again. 
we're offering a non-aggression pact. That's interesting. That's interesting. I mean, we have a truce until 2240, but... They are receptive. We have some trust due to commercial pact. This is gonna cost me 0.25 and flunts again. Oh... Sure, we'll, we'll, we'll go with the non-aggression pact. This is this is fine actually. I'm happy with this. Let's let's just make sure that these guys don't attack us. So we're still on our friendly little hug box. The, the galaxy is probably whoa! I did not know that we knew about the Mishar over there. Interesting bombardment policy. Minus ten. Our bombardment policy. A noisy xenophobic isolationists? What? What the heck? <laughs> How does that work? So commercial pack minus 157. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be able to bribe these guys into anything. That's that's fine though. But yeah, for now I'm gonna end it here. Next time we're probably gonna continue colonizing now that we have like three planets built up and yeah, we'll just try to to out tech, to out unite our our neighbors and our enemies trying to spread the faith of the brain slugs um probably in the empire of the hellwind confederation first and then maybe there might be some sort of hostile style takeover over here or something we'll see how that goes hope you join me next time bye bye